Hello, this is Mark Vila with Coldesi, and today we're here to compare DTF, or direct to film, with white toner printing. For the past few years, white toner printing has been really hot with the digital heat effects line of printers, and now DTF is really catching some speed and catching some interest out there, so we're going to go ahead and break it down for you. In a comparison of DTF and white toner printing from digital heat effects, we can just go ahead and start with what they have in common. These are things that are going to be universal across both of these technologies. The first one is going to be that they are both print on a clear film. This makes it so much easier to work with when you're trying to line things up on your heat press. Both of these transfers can be printed, cut up, and then stored or sold to somebody else later. So these transfers are transferable for use at a later date. The transfers in both technologies do print white, which is a must for printing dark colored garments. They will both print on a variety of textiles too. So you can print on cotton, polyester, and blends with both the DTF and the white toner printer. And also, as I mentioned before, you can print on dark color and light color garments, making them both extremely versatile. And the last thing to mention is that the prints for both of these are very thin. It's a, it's a very thin layer of ink or toner that's being put on the garment. So it will work on heavyweight type fabrics, but also if you wanted to put it on lightweight tees or tanks. Now I'd like to talk about some of the advantages of each technology. So let's go ahead and start with white toner printing. When you're printing with a digital heat effects white toner printer, the key word in that is toner. That means that there are no liquid inks, which means that there's less maintenance. Since the digital heat effects printers are using toner, you can actually just turn the machines off and let them sit for a while without anything need to be done. White toner printers like the Creo and the Uninet are really user friendly from the technology standpoint when you have to change your consumables. So to change toners, drums, fusers, things like that, it's very low tech, very easy to do. One of the things you might have noticed about white toner printers is actually they're pretty compact. So they easily fit on a tabletop and they're also pretty quiet too. So they just don't make a lot of noise and they don't have that industrial sound. Another feature about white toner printers that's just not spoken about enough is that you can remove the white and put in a black toner and convert it to a regular CMYK toner printer, which means you can print things just like regular paper, invitations, promotional items like flyers too. And the last thing to mention about white toner printing like the Creo and the Uninet is that your cost of entry is really low. It's one of the lowest costs of entries for a completely versatile system to be able to print transfers, make t-shirts, and more. Now I'd like to talk about some of the benefits of direct-to-film printing. The first one is just speed. You can print logos in seconds. DTF also offers roll printing, so you can actually do big production with a DTF printer. And all of the steps are done within the machine. So you click print and it rolls and does all of the steps that by the time it exits the machine, it's a completed transfer. Once the transfer is done, the time on the press is super fast for DTF. So you can apply it to a shirt in about 10 seconds. You can also make your transfers huge or do a ton of them at once as the width of some of the paper can go up to 24 inches by 100 meters long. Once you've completed your transfers and you put them on a t-shirt, they are just ultra soft and they have a pretty good stretch to them too. And then when you deliver them to your customers and they wash them and wash them, they're just gonna love how the washes last over time. The last thing to mention is the cost of supplies. It's really inexpensive to produce DTF prints, which is a must for high production shops. So thanks for watching this video comparing DTF for direct to film to white toner printing in the digital heat effects line. If you'd like to learn more about either of these transfer printing technologies, then visit digitalheateffects.com and live chat with one of our pros.